What's going on, peeps? Today we're doing a hunting challenge to see if Target or Walmart is the best place to actually go to for cards. We got three criteria to actually follow today. One is going to be price. Two is going to be availability. And three is going to be the pulls. Which store is going to come out on top? We're about to find out right now. Let's go to them. Make sure you do like and subscribe. First store up will be Walmart. Let's see what they got in there. All right, so up front at this Walmart, we got some Shining Fates right there. We got a semi-opened uh, Sword and Shield ETB right there. Got some Pikachu boxes, not too bad. Some Pikachu boxes down there as well. Some Shining Fate box right there. We got a little Cleavor Beast Star right there too. I see some more Picos down below as well. We don't see anything in the back. We may end up getting a few of those Pikachu boxes and pretty much call it a day. Not really seeing much else up here I want. I actually did see over here. They actually had some DBZ. Gotta love some DBZ cards too. I may pick up a few of those just to uh, open those up on the live on Sunday. Oh, but they have quite a bit more in the back, actually. We may get two of these tins and actually open these up instead. I don't know, I'm still trying to decide between these tins. I actually got the Flareon tin actually back there. I think the Jolteon tin right there. Mmm, not bad, not bad. Dragonite box right there, too. A lot of Vivid Voltage, Sword and Shield, and all those ETBs. Uh, they are now priced at $44.98. KC was telling me they were still $39.99. Not anymore. Shining Face boxes right here, though. Gotta like those. And then a little bit of a Zashian action. The V. Union. Not too bad. Not a bad selection at all down here. But I'm thinking we actually may get one of these tins and probably one of these boxes. And that'll pretty much go to right about $50 in this store, which is kind of crazy. You can only get a tin in a box, but you know what? We'll try it out. I'm a huge Lucario fan, so we'll actually pick out this Lucario tin right here. And then I was always actually a fan of the Hoopa boxes that are actually down here. So let's actually pick the one that we actually want to get. One, two, let's go with number three. I got a feeling about number three today. Ooh, and it's actually, look, look at that. You can kind of see a little bit of the code card. I know the pack's still in there. Definitely gonna open this bad boy. Maybe there's something in that Evolving Skies. We also got my boy Charizard up there. We love that, as well as the Gengar. Gengar action. So all in all, I would say the selection at Walmart, pretty good in the back. No single packs, though, sadly. All right, so Walmart had a lot of boxes and a lot of tins in there, too. Some ETBs as well, but not a lot of single packs. We were forced to actually get a tin as well as a box, totaling to about $47 after tax. So now it's time we head over to Target and see what they got in store for us. Hopefully they got some single packs, because we're gonna also have to equal out about $47. So this is definitely definitely a fair match. Target's turn. Let's see what they got for us. All right, so sadly in this Target, they got this thing blocking me right now, but they actually do got some of those two packs over there. They got some of the Vivid Volt ETB, some Darkness of Blazes, Lucario. They also got these single blisters right here. Man, I'll honestly, I actually may get one of those treasure chests right there, also known as the collector's chest, because that's actually the best deal, guys. It's $29.99 in here. All the boxes are a little bit cheaper, by the way. Seeing as how this actually comes with seven packs in it, this is a lot better deal. Honestly, this right here alone is almost the amount of packs that we got from Walmart all together so that's kind of crazy all right going to check in the back but target is already in the lead right now just because of price alone oh this was not part of the plan but i may actually be getting that squirrel that would not be part of the money they were actually spending i've not seen these squirrels here yet oh that's really cute oh they got a big gengar too now oh that is awesome i know it's 40 bucks so we got to pass on it i also passed on the squirrels too because they were all dirty so i'm gonna keep my eye out for another one eventually but oh my god this gengar yeah and target's absolutely stacked with boxes tens ETBs. I gotta say, this is probably a bigger selection than Walmart, too. And even more stuff over here. And honestly, they actually got some of these tins down here. I think I'll grab one of these, because that will still, even after I get these tins, be cheaper than what we spent at Walmart on the boxes. So that's absolutely crazy. Target definitely winning in both stock and price now. See what I was talking about with all the squirrels? They're all dirty. Eventually, we'll get one. Eventually. Eventually, squirrel. Don't worry, buddy. We'll be back. Oh, they got Jigglypuff up there, too. Jigglypuff. Alright, so after check, I end up being 41 48, which is about five to six dollars cheaper than it was at Walmart to get less packs. Absolutely crazy. Target, definitely the place to go over Walmart whenever you want to get Pokemon stuff in this hunt. But now let's go on and head back because we have three criteria price, availability, and pulls. Let's see what we get. And now we are back. So we got our Walmart as well as our Target. As we saw in the video, Walmart a little more overpriced than the Target was, but that's okay. Hopefully the pulls from Walmart are a little bit better and Target's gonna take this outright. Little something to show you though, on the way home, I actually stopped by work and I picked up something really cool. So the actual surprise of the day, this is actually my boss, by the way, at PetSmart, Mr. Victor, also known as Callen's Life on YouTube. His link will actually be in the description down below. You guys definitely need to check him out because he actually made something that some of y'all might actually want. Yes. That is a actual Pokeball shell. 
shelf. You can actually see it has a shelf down here, two right here and one up top. They kind of blend in together because they did an amazing job. That is an LED light right in the middle. And then we've actually got lights surrounding this thing as well. It's not plugged in, obviously, because, you know, it's still in the car. Like, Super fun to make, man. Super guys, go make. check awesome. out the video down below once again. I'm going to link the actual video of him making this thing yeah. Yeah. so you guys can see how much work actually goes in to actually making this shelf. It was, so, it was, it was, it was a lot of crazy uh, measurements. Making a circle is... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> circles are hard for Cir us. Circles are difficult. Yep, this thing is absolutely amazing. Cannot believe he actually put this together so quickly. Callan's Life, a great channel to check out, guys. So once again, please go check them out. And if you want to see this thing lit up you're gonna have to stop by sunday evening 8 30 eastern standard time because we got a live coming up we're gonna be lighting this thing up but now it's time to open up our goodies i say we actually start with walmart see if they got some good enough pools to actually keep themselves in the races if not target's definitely taking this one all right here we go we got our hoopa box from walmart and we also got the lucario box we open up as well i say we actually start out with our hoopa box see if we can get anything cool out of this then we'll pop open that the lucario 10 see if we can get something out of there if this is your first time to the cave guys welcome welcome and if you're returning welcome back you know how much I appreciate all the support that we get here. There was that pack hanging out in the back right there. Chilling Rain. We got Fusion Strike, another Fusion Strike, and an Evolving Skies. Code card right there for the box. Let's go ahead and dive into these packs right here. I said we start out with Chilling Rain, do some Fusion Strike in the middle, and then end on Evolving Skies. Still hunting for that Umbreon VMAX Alt Art. Let's see if we can get him today. That would be absolutely crazy if we do. All right, here we go. First pack of the day, Chilling Pain. Can you bring us something tasty? Let's go, you know what, water for this one. Ah, well, there we go. Starting off right with an energy guest like that. We got a little Whirlipede, Snow Runt, Venipede, a little Snow Ver, Slow Poke, Crub Brawler. Slurpuff's going to be the reverse in that one. And a Bayonet is going to be the rare for that. So nothing crazy in our first pack. Code card for you right there. Let's dive into another one. Here we go. Fusion Strike action. See if we can get out of Fusion Strike. Still looking for that VMAX Mew alt art. That would be absolutely crazy to pull, too. Let's see if we can get it today. Or any alt art, really. Let's flip it over. Let's go Psychic for this one. Oh, my goodness. Two in a row. We are Psychics today. We got a little Prime Ape right there. Eevee, Shinx. We got a little Shelmet, Drillbert, Bunnelby. Vulpex going to be the reverse in that one. And a Hunt Tail is going to be the rare. All right. Box not starting off great. Code card right there. Down to another one. Here we go. Third from the box. Fusion Strike action. See if we can get something out of this box would be nice just saying walmart you want to stay in the race you got to give us something good but uh, let's go fire for this one uh, electric energy well you know our streak had to end and it ended its too we got a little star you right there mahuaya little makuhita pan poor solata with the right you hanging out got a little del caddy like that as the reverse and a cloister is gonna be the rare all right this box is being bad code card right there for the fusion strike all right here we go evolving skies can you save this box I really hope so, or we picked a definite dud box from Walmart today. Let's go ahead and flip this thing over and see what we got. Let's go, you know what, water for this one too. Well, it's grass. That's okay, though. That's okay. We got a Hapowden right there. Gold Ducks, Bagon, Wobbuffet, Litleo, Lil Dwebble, Hippo. Thievel's gonna be the reverse in that one. It's definitely off cut right there. Heavy bottom. And an Altaria. Wow, nothing in that box. Code card right there for the Evolving Skies. All right, Walmart is not starting off great. Let's go ahead and get into this Lucario 10 that we actually got right here. See if we can get something out of this just to keep them in the race at this point. Uh, Walmart is definitely hurting. Oh my goodness. All right, here we go. We got Vivid Voltage, Vivid Voltage, Sword and Shield, and a Burning Shadows. Do we have the Charizard in that Burning Shadows? If we do, then I'm pretty sure Walmart's probably going to take this one just for the pulls alone. Let's actually do one of these numbers. Save that Burning Shadows for last. Go ahead and open up some Sword and Shield base. Got a little Lapras on the front. You know how I love me some Lapras. May actually go water energy for this one. Yeah, thinking water? Let's do it. Well, it's fighting. That's okay, though. We're, we're not mad about it. Bay Day, got a little Ordinary Rod, Roselia, Rhyhorn, Sobble, got a little Grookey, Wooloo, a little Thievil, another Thievil as the reverse, and a Dreadnought. All right, all right, not bad, not bad. Let's go ahead and get the code card right there for that Sword and Shield, down into a Vivid Volt. Here we go. All right, Vivid Volt, can you bring us something good? Can we get something good from Walmart? I, I just want something. Can we just get something from Walmart? Let's flip it over. Let's go Electric for this one. Well, it's darkness. That's okay, though. That's okay. Hit him on top right there. Macargo, Drone Rotom, Little Eevee. Let me know, guys. Do you get better hits from Walmart or from Target? I'm a huge, huge fan of Target. Vaporeon Reverse, though. Gotta like that. And Electros. But Walmart does usually bring us some good hits. Not getting really anything crazy, though. We only got two packs left from Walmart. It's been almost $50 and got absolutely nothing. So, <laughs> Just saying, not very happy with Walmart right now. Let's flip this over. Let's go, you know what, electric again. 
Well, it's grass. Once again, that's okay. We got a wash energy right there. We got a little bath, an EV, got a C dot, electric, Clefairy, Clefairy, a fan P, reverse grab lock, not too bad. Oh, we actually do got a full art. We'll take it. Oh, very nice. I actually did not have this from Vivid Voltage. I love it. All right, so we actually dig in something today from our Walmart run. Not bad at all, not bad at all. Let's get a sleeve of this Pokemon Center lady right there. Very nice. I've honestly never even seen this card before. Ah, I really like this card. I really like this card a lot. All right, let's go ahead and put that right beside the Bulbasaur right there. Get the code card away for the Vivid Volt pack. We got our last pack. Can this 10 hits with something else? Is the Charizard in this one? That would be crazy. We got a Pokemon Center lady and a Charizard. That would be awesome. It'd be really cool if we did. Just saying, come on, Burning Shadows, give it to us. Let's go fire for this one. Ah, psychic energy. Well, you know I'm not a psychic here. Porygon, too. A little Metapod. I got an Inke. Stuffle. Crab Brawler. A Moralol. Sandy Gas. Reverse Porygon Z. Come on, something tasty. Ah, oh, wow. The other Porygon Z. Deja vu right there. There's the code card for that Burning Shadows. All right, so now it's time we actually open up our stuff that we got at Target. Uh, I will say that's a nice hit from Vivid Volt. I'm not mad about it, but... We actually got nine packs to actually open instead of eight from Target, and it was a little bit cheaper. So Target, once again, leading in selection as well as leading in price, too. So hopefully, this treasure chest or the collector's chest right here is going to have something cool for us as well. Love this chest so much. The Arceus. We got the, you know, all the stickers. We got the promos right in the front right there, which are really cool. But the thing we care about most is these packs right inside. So let's go ahead and get that thing out of the way right there. Let's see what packs we got. We got Vivid Voltage, Vivid Voltage. Ooh, are these turned around? Ooh, here we go. We got a little code card for you guys right there. There you go for the chest. And we got a Brilliant Stars. We got another Vivid Volt, Evolving Skies and Fusion Strike. Wow. That's a good pack selection right there, gotta say. And then we'll actually get this 10 open too. So we can actually see the pack selection up in here. I'm pretty sure I remember what's actually in this one. If I'm not mistaken, it's definitely, yep, it's gonna be a fusion strike and a chilling rain. All right, so we'll add those, but let's actually go ahead. Let's start out with some chilling pain. We'll actually end on evolving skies just in case there's something crazy in there. We'll do the uh, brilliant stars kind of in the middle. All right, here we go. Chilling rain pack. Can we get something good out of this one? All right, so. Target already with an advantage right now of having nine cup packs versus eight. Let's see, let's go water for this one. Well, we got that right once again. Chilling rain, we're getting the uh, energy guesses, but uh, maybe there's a hit in here to make up for the uh, the last one that we opened. Maybe, maybe, we'll see right now. Single strike Urshifu, reverse rare, and a Pissimian is gonna be the rare for that one. All right, so not too great from our chilling pain today. Let's go ahead and get the code card away for that pack. Go ahead and dive into our Vivid Volt. All right, we already got a full art that I didn't have crazily enough out of Vivid Voltage. Let's see if we can get something else. Come on, Vivid Volt, bring us something tasty today. I guess I should say something else tasty. Let's go electric for this one. Well, fighting energy, that's okay, that's okay. We got a Carolus right there, Stone Energy, Chewdle, Riolu, got the Kimiko, Ninkata, Voltorb, Shuckle's gonna be the reverse in that one, and a Lycanroc's gonna be the rare. All right, that's okay, that's okay. We're not mad about it. Code card right there for that Vivid Volt pack, now another one. We got one more Vivid Volt after this, then we got some Fusion Strike, we had some Brilliant Stars, Evolving Skies. Love this little selection that we got for basically around $40. So that was a pretty good deal at Target. Let's flip this over. Let's go water for this one again. Leaf energy. You know, I got to guess leaf today. I have yet to guess leaf, and we've been getting a lot of them. We got Wishma right there. Trubish. Got a Tynamo. Clobopus. Reverse Duraludon. And a Lucario. All right, so that treasure chest not being so nice to us so far. We got another Vivid Bolt. See if we can get something out of that treasure chest today. I don't know. I'm, I'm still pretty happy about the Pokemon Center Lady. Let's flip it over. Let's go, you know what, Leaf for this one. Well, it's electric. Of course, the one time that I, you know, is Vivid Volt and I don't guess electric, it's electric. Voltorb, we got a Riolu, Dot, and Electrike. League Staff's gonna be the reverse, and a Flareon. Very nice, you know I love my evolutions, but not what I was looking for. Code cards right there for those two Vivid Volt packs. All right, here we go. We got five packs left. Brilliant Stars, Fusion Strike, and a little bit of Evolving Skies. Here we go. Can we get an alt art out of these last five packs? I know there are alt arts in every single set. We hadn't pulled an alt art in a little while. It'd be really nice if we could right now. Let's flip this over. Let's go fire for this one. 
There we go. We're getting the energy guesses right today. I'm liking that. Executor. Got a little Mencino. Ball toy. Snow run. A little nose pass. Milsuri. Clang Clang is going to be the reverse in that one. Not bad. And a Garchomp is going to be the hollow. Okay, so we actually did get something out of that one. But it, once again, it's only a hollow. Code card right there for the Brilliant Stars. Dab to another one. Here we go. All right, so, so far... Walmart is technically leading in one of our criteria, but there are two more things we got to think about, and that is, you know, the pull. So let's see if we can get something good out of this one. Let's go, you know what, electric for this one. Ah, psychic energy. Well, once again, you know I'm not a psychic here. We got an executor right there, ball toy, a little snow runt, nose pass, got a Dedenne, little cub chew, golet's gonna be the reverse on that one, not bad. Oh, we actually do got a full art in this one. Let's go, is it gonna be an alt art? No, it is not, but it is a Luminion full art. Very nice. Love that fish, and I know M loves this fish even more. All right, well, let's go ahead and sleeve this thing up. All right, so now Target has kind of matched Walmart full art for full art. So, oh my goodness, Walmart, you just got a big old punch right there. Let's go. We got Fusion Strike right here. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, so now I'm pretty happy about that. Brilliant Star is hitting us pretty good, which means there was a full art actually in that treasure box. Let's flip this over. Let's go Psychic for this one. There we go. We are a Psychic today. Got a Turtonator, a little Fusion Strike energy, more Pico. Got a Phalanx, a Growlithe. Got a Ndidi, a little Daramuka right there. Ooh, Golem Reverse. Very nice. See what's behind this one? It's a V. It's a Cinderace V. Very nice. This was actually miscut. Look how sharp that edge is right there. Oh, we like a miscut card here. Code cards right there for the Brilliant Stars and the Fusion Strike. We got one more Fusion Strike, and then we got our Evolving Skies. Come on, Fusion Strike. Can we get anything else good? from Target today. If we do, they definitely won outright in this battle. Let's flip this over. Let's go fire for this one. Psychic. Well, I thought I was a psychic. I guess I'm not. We got a spongy gloves right there. Frost Moth, little Ruka D, Daramuka, Sizzlepeed, Stuffle, little Sandy Gast, Reverse Skarmory, and a Lavani is going to be the rare for that one. All right, one more pack left, and it's going to be the Evolving Skies. Let's go ahead and give away our Fusion Strike code card right there. Open it up, the Evolving Skies pack. Last pack of the day. Can we get some last pack magic? Thank you guys so much for joining me out there on the hunt. Absolutely amazing whenever we can find stuff out in the wild. Let's flip this over. Let's go. I want the Umbreon. We're going darkness. Leaf energy. That's okay. That's okay. We got a Scroll the Fang Dragon, Flow Wet, got a Tentacool, Pikachu, got a C Dot, a Lily Pup, got a Bag on, Reverse Wishy Washy. Miss M loves using a Wishy Washy. See what our last card It's going to be a full art. Oh my goodness. That means Target wins outright. Let's see what it is. Very nice. Little Gordy action. One of the most hated full arts. Two full arts versus one. So now you know that Target has the best prices, best selection, and also has the best hits. If you want to enjoy another hunting video, go ahead and check this one out though right here. But as always in the cave, from me to you, happy hunting.